Hey friends, today I'm going to read The Knight and the Dragon. It's one of my favorites by Tommy DePaola. I hope you like it too. It's a little unexpected. So The Knight and the Dragon. Once upon a time, there was a knight in a castle who had never fought a dragon. And in a cave, not too far away, was a dragon who had never fought a knight. One day, the knight went to the castle library and took out all of the books he could find on dragon fighting. Meanwhile, back at the cave, the dragon had rummaged through all the things from his ancestors and found some books on knight fighting. The knight began to build some armor. So he's melting metal, he's pouring it into a mold. And there, little by little, he makes a suit of armor. The dragon practiced swishing his tail. You see him, he's reading his book and then he's practicing and look at that big smile. I think he likes his swishing tail. Meanwhile, back at the castle, the knight is making a sword and all kinds of tools and he painted his shield. He looks like he's ready. And meanwhile, back at the cave, look at that dragon. He's practicing in a mirror. How fierce can he look? He's ferocious. And here they're practicing more. The knight is running at a homemade dragon. And what happens? He runs, he runs, he runs, and he misses it. And he ends up in a tree. And the dragon is practicing running at his straw knight. And it looks like he too misses his mark. Oh, look at them here. But finally, the knight got the dragon, and the dragon, look at all those knights. He looks so pleased with himself. Finally, the knight and the dragon were both ready. They sent each other a letter and set a time for the fight. And here they go, and they're charging at each other. The dragon is charging, the knight is charging, and whoa, they miss. They run right past each other. Okay, they're gonna try again. The knight is up on his horse. The dragon is breathing fire, and oh no, they miss again. The dragon ended up in a pond, and the knight ends up in a tree. Oh, and here's someone coming along. It's the librarian. She gives the dragon a book called The Outdoor Cookbook. And she gives the knight a book called How to Build a Barbecue. And here they are sitting together reading their new books. And look what they do. They open the K-N-D barbecue joint with B Dragon and Sir Knight proprietors. Look at that. The dragon is the chef. And look at the knight delivering all that delicious looking food. The end. I love this one because one, the librarian sort of saved the day, didn't she? And I really like librarians. The librarian, she had courage to be more creative and she knew that cooperating and working together is usually a much better plan than fighting anyway. And now look at that. They have a successful restaurant and a new friend. So I hope you enjoyed the night and the dragon today. I'm sure you're doing a lot of cooperating in your families at home. Keep it up and we will see you again soon. Bye-bye.